Hello everyone and welcome to another Dr. Boy Box review. Today I'm going to be having a look at the history of the Daleks, set number one, simply to put it, the Daleks. Now I originally know that I said that I would be reviewing the power of the Daleks set, however I don't have it on hand at the moment. I still have to go out and get it. So until then I thought it would be a good idea to go over previous sets that have been released, such as the Seas of Doom set, Cast Revolver, History of the Daleks 1, 2, 3, 4, the TARDIS sets that have been released over the last two years, you get the point. So I will be doing Power of the Daleks, but until then I will be reviewing the previous sets that have been released. It's nice to see another re-release of the original Daleks. There was only one release, and that was back in the original Dalek Collector set number 1. I never got that set as a kid, so it's really nice to see this mould being used once more. As you can see with this set, they've decided to go with some creative license and actually make the two Daleks different. As you can see, one of the irises on the Dalek is smaller than the other. As you can see with this set, we're also treated to a lovely backdrop of the corridors of Scarrow. It's a nice addition to place your figures in if you want to display them. The articulation is standard once again, 360 head, eye moves up and down, ball jointed plunger and gun, and it's on three wheels. In terms of my thoughts about this set, it's really nice to have next to William Hartnell and his other figures, although they're just standard Daleks, so there's nothing really new to bring to the table apart from the new Iris variation. But considering that the original Daleks were only released once, I'm not going to complain at all, and I can't wait to see what more character have in store for us, such as Planet of the Daleks, Evil of the Daleks, so on and so forth. The only reason why I think it's a huge advantage is because it expands the collection a little bit more. So thank you for watching everyone. I hope you like, comment and subscribe. Tell me your thoughts in the comments what you think about these sets. Don't forget to message Anthony Fagan on Facebook to join the B&M group. And I will see you next time when I will review History of the Daleks set number 2, The Dalek Invasion of Earth. Don't forget that I'll also be going back over previous figures that have been released, so don't miss out on those. Thank you for watching and I shall see you all next time. Bye-bye.